hello everyone how to solve this problem for the values of c if we have three times of c plus 7 is equals to 42 and we solve this problem for all the values of c so here first we find all the roots of this equation and at the last we will be verify that which of the roots are solution of this equation and which of the roots are extraneous root uh, so please watch this video at the end uh, further we solve this problem for two methods i hope so you like both of these methods but if you have any other method in your mind so please don't hesitate to write this method into the comment section and uh, now here in the first method we just direct multiply these three on both of these two values uh, so that when we multiply these three on c it will be written as three times of c plus and when we multiply this 3 with 7 we get here 3 times 7 becomes 21 is equals to 42 and, and now here further in the next step uh, because we solve this problem for the values of c so that's why we move this plus 21 to the right hand side and it will be written as 3c is equals to 42 minus 21 and now you see here 42 minus uh, 21 is equals to this is 2 minus 1 becomes 1 and 4 minus 2 becomes here 2 this means that 42 minus 21 becomes 21 and in the left hand side we will get here 3c only so because we solve this problem for the values of c only that's why we need to eliminate this c from left hand side so when we eliminate c from left hand side so that we divide both of the sides by 3 and when we divide both of the sides by 3 it will be written as in this form and now you see here this 3 is cancelled out by this 3 and we will get here c is equal to when we divide 21 by 3 it will be written as 3 7 are 21 so here you clearly see that we easily get the value of c is equals to 7. So uh, here in the first method we just get only one root of the given equation and now here in the next steps we will be verify that is this root of the given equation is satisfied our given question statement or is this root be the extraneous root. For this we need to copy down given question statement here it is 3 times of c plus 7 is equal to 42 and now we verify this value of c so that we put this value of c into the left hand side of this equation and when we put this value here it will be written as 3 times of c plus 7 and when you substitute this value here it will become 3 times of 7 plus 7 is equal to 42 this is the our claim we verify that is our left hand side becomes 42 or not okay uh, so here we have this is 3 times of 7 plus 7 becomes 14 and here we check that is this equals to 42 or not and now you see here we get 3 times of 14 is equals to 42 equals to 42 so this means that the value of c is equals to 7 is satisfied over this question statement because both of the sides are equal. So if this value is satisfied over a given question statement, uh, this means that uh, the solution set of given question is c is equals to 7. Okay. So this is the solution set of the given equation and now here I can explain the difference between a solution and extraneous root uh, so the roots which is satisfied our given question statements is called the solution and the roots which does not satisfy our given question statement is called the extraneous root but here unfortunately we cannot get any extraneous root uh, we have only one solution of the given equation and that is seven only okay so now here further we solve this problem for the second method uh, and i hope so you like both of these methods so uh, in the second method we need to copy down given question statement here the given question statement is 3 times of c plus 7 is equals to 42 this is the our given question statement 
and in the second method i can just uh, give you another technique uh, how to find the value of c in another or some smartest method okay so here in this method we first eliminate this three from left hand side for this uh, we need to divide both of the sides by three so when you divide both of the sides by three it will be written as three times of c plus seven divided by three is equals to 42 divided by three and now you see here this three is cancelled out by this three and we will get here c plus seven is equals to this is three ones are three and we carry 1 and 3 4s are 12 so we get here 14 only okay so in the right hand side we get 14 and now we solve this problem for the values of c so that we move this plus 7 to the right hand side and it will be written as c is equals to 14 minus 7 and we know that 14 minus 7 is equals to 7 only so this is the value of c which we get here from second method and you see here from both of these methods we will get same values of c also in the first method we already verified this value of c and this value of c is satisfied our given question statement so the solution set of the given question is 7 okay this is the final answer of this question and thank you so much for watching this video please subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos